Hello there everyone, this is Chillinus. Welcome back to another NeoFly Career Microsoft Flight Sim video. I want to apologize that it has been so long since we have played NeoFly on the channel. I've been live streaming it a little bit as I am currently live streaming right now. But we are... We're finally getting back into it. We have just finished our C qualification as well for a... Uh, a mono turbo turbo monoprop as you can see here on neofly we have passed with a three star rating i'm not sure how fast we landed on our touch and go but we barely touched the runway and went off again and then our final landing was three five feet per minute which was pretty awesome we're currently in shell harbor in new south wales just south of sydney we're going to be flying into sydney proper with that we are also carrying uh, 15 magazines, each worth roughly $430, as long as we can land this thing. So we're going to be landing in Sydney. I need to set up the plane here, so I'm going to go through my checklist. I'm pretty sure everything should be good and won't take too long. hope everyone's having a fantastic day. I hope you enjoy the fact that Neofly is back on the channel. I am a little laggy. I didn't realize Neofly was up either. That's my bad. So everything that I've just talked about, you haven't seen. And I'll probably cut it in the edit too. But essentially we're going to taxi to here all the way down across one way uh, roughly to eight. And then make our way all the way to runway three, four. Let's set up an altitude. I want to be roughly 2,500. I think I actually want to be higher than that. I think I want to be more uh, 3,700. I'm pretty sure that's what I saw on the flight chart. I might be wrong, but I'm not going to look it up either. I just want to get flying into Sydney. It's honestly been so long. And the fact that I crashed right before we got to Sydney was just... Horrific. As we line up, I will set the heading and we can take off from there. Flaps one, take off flaps. We are not at all lined up with the center line. I'm going to set the heading here and let's go. Very bad takeoff by me. As we very gently take off. I think I took off from the wrong runway. I think I was still meant to keep going. That was totally my bad. Then on the autopilot here, we'll continue to swing our heading around so that it intercepts our navigation course. And I'm going to tune to Sydney International airfield from here, even though that isn't exactly how you would do things in the real world. King Smith International, I want to tune their ATIS. And we're going to listen for which runway is the active. 3-4 left and 3-4 right. So we are coming in north. Oh, we're going into the north. We're going to slide right in. That's lovely. Uh, I'm pretty sure all parking for small planes is on right. From there, we'll set an approach. We will VNAV 3-4 uh, right. Via NDEV load that right now and there we go we are now on our way to sydney and this is the plane we are flying the <laughs> the really awesome looking tour um cessna 208b 
Grand Caravan. I painted this one myself because I didn't want to fly a basic 208, so that's why we're flying this one here. It looks awesome. I just realized that we still have flaps one on. So I want to apologize to you guys watching this video that it's been a while since I have recorded a Neofly video. As you may have seen, I accidentally over, well, I lost the uh, progression for Neofly. And when I backed it up, I, uh, when I restored the backup, it was quite far back. Shortly after that, I started to feel really sick. I deal with a lot of stomach-based issues. I couldn't really sit at the computer a whole lot, unfortunately. Then I started wanting to do a Guru Truck uh, Simulator set of videos, so I got that one sorted as I was catching back up to our first captain rank. Uh, sorry, first captain, first officer rank. So after trying to get all that sorted, I ended up uh, with quite severe stomach issues for a couple of days. Uh, I had some tooth pain, had to get that one there extracted. Yeah, then I had more stomach issues, so that was another day. Now I'm feeling pretty good. And that's why videos are always kind of intermittent on the channel. I'm going to request a full stop landing to Sydney. Sydney. Tower Cessna Charlie Hotel 821 is tree zero miles south 3,700 feet with right golf there, I think. Charlie Hotel 821 Sydney Tower. Altimeter tree zero decimal one eight wind two five seven at one tree. Fly straight in runway tree four left. Alright, we're going three four Make left. Straight in runway tree four left Cessna eight two one. Uh so we will select the approach three four left, even though I set it up for three four right via sausage or sausage. What a cool transition name, sausage. Coming up onto the sausage approach right now, being 30 seconds away. I think we're still a little too high for our next one, but I'm going to capture the glide slope here from now. The glide slope should start coming downwards. So I will slow down to 150 knots, even though I'm pretty sure we can come in much faster than that. But I want to, the moment that we capture that glide slope, I want to be able to put on the flaps. We are now also below 150, so the moment we capture that glide path, I'm going to put on flaps one, and then as we come over Hold final, three, I will put on flaps two, or landing flaps. I will then also change the view to be higher up over the dashboard, not only for your viewing pleasure, but for mine. Here is the runway we'll be landing, two, four left, wait, three, four left, sorry go over the flight assistant here the landing speed is anywhere between 65 and 88 knots so as we come in maybe 95 knots would be not such a bad idea we are now on final flaps two and as you can see Clear to land, runway tree, four left. Clear to land, runway tree, four left, Cessna 821. Let's set the view to be up over the top so you can see the nose. And that is right about where we want to be on our speed. We're going to speed up a little more as we are losing a little bit of speed. Such a cool visual coming into Sydney, seeing the planes coming right across the beach. And we are now getting pretty low. I will disconnect the autopilot. A trim feels a little strange. We're very off the center line. Get back on it. Miss that taxiway. Cessna eight two one contact ground on one two six decimal five. 
One two six decimal five for Cessna eight two one. Cessna Charlie Hotel eight two one taxi to General Aviation parking via taxiway Bravo Niner Kilo Charlie cross runway two five Charlie Charlie two golf. Up there, so around that way. Oh, we're actually coming across here. Maybe I'll look into doing some VAT sim at some stage. Do the uh, the flight test and everything. When they say cross runway, how do they determine which runway you're crossing? Since it can, uh, since it goes both ways. Is it whatever end you're closest to? Is it the direction you're traveling? I always wondered that. But welcome everyone to Sydney. If you have enjoyed your flight with air, well with break it all, I guess is what I'm calling it. Taxiing to General Aviation Park. The same as our trucking company. If you have enjoyed this flight with break it all, be sure to rate it five stars on Yelp. We're a newly formed company and any sort of feedback is very precious. And if you want, we have an FBO on Flight Sim Economy. Info for that can be found on Discord. You can check down in the description. There is a link for it there. So if you're interested in that, join in the Discord and there is a channel under Flight Simulation or Flight Sim called FBO that you can get all that information from. Right, let's go slow. We have arrived in Sydney. If you have enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on it and subscribe to see more. I'm I'm happy. I'm going to go sell our uh, our magazines and everything that I am carrying. Going to make some money, and I will see you in the next video. Until then, everyone, take care and ciao.